Yes, indeed. Following that Bengals loss, fans will be arriving back to Cincinnati here soon. WCPO 9 News anchor Adrian Whitsett has been in Los Angeles all week long. He joins us from LAX this morning after catching up with those fans. You know, Adrian, before we get to that, I have a Valentine for you. Are you ready? <laughs> sure. <laughs> Our connection is like Joe to Jamar. I, I would agree. I would agree. And I haven't seen you in weeks, Julie. Uh, I don't even know what to do with that. Uh, so let me let me tell you this. I am I'm going off zero sleep right now. So my brain's not functioning in the same way that it probably would. But that's OK. Uh, yeah, of course, we were outside uh, SoFi Stadium last night as that game ended. Uh, you, you've mentioned these words, heartbreak and, and devastating, but I, I, I just want us to remember something. This was a team that when we got to Tennessee, when they took on the Nashville Titans, had never won a road playoff game. They won that one, they went to Kansas City, and they beat Kansas City, and then they were here for the Super Bowl in year two of Joe Burrow under center. I mean, absolutely amazing and nothing, no single fan, no Bengals player should look at this as less than an accomplishment. Uh, the fans we talked to last night, surely feeling the sting of loss, but definitely looking to the future with hope. I remembered um, Stanford Jennings running the touchdown back against the 49ers. We were up by seven. It reminded me of that. And, um, you know, up until the very end, we had it. With 10 minutes less left in this game, we were up by four. Would you take that in September? I said, absolutely, I would. And so it was a bad beat on the end, but we had chances. Love the team, love what they've done with the team. I think next year is looking good, man. Yeah, things are looking good. That was kind of the refrain we heard from the Bengals fans that we talked to. Still some anger and, and as I mentioned, the sting of this defeat. But looking ahead, they think that there is something very special here. The Bengals players know it. The fans know it. Uh, there were a lot of people out there, though, uh, in Rams gear who didn't seem to care that the Rams had just won the Super Bowl, which is the weirdest thing for me uh, in the experience as we left SoFi Stadium last night so uh bengals fans you showed out you were loud you were proud it was absolutely amazing uh just outside sofi stadium last night for super bowl 56 so nothing to to be ashamed of there julie not uh, not at all and and boy that seems to be the takeaway everybody has and a lot of excitement about the future and uh we just get through it thanks adrian um it is 506